reflexology treatment with the hands. And at first we're working on the manicure, getting those nails down to an appropriate length. And once we do all the clipping, you do some you do the filing, file a nice smooth beveled edge to the nails, and then we'll put on a cuticle softener, push back to cuticles, and do some reflexology. So that's kind of the, the way things are going to go. However, we do have a specific concern here with our client's right hand. Uh, we have a finger that uh, needs special attention, actually a fingernail itself. So if we see here, we have this fingernail that we're going to work on to make it appear uh, in keeping with the others who we do have a special condition. Now this has been alleviated over the years and um, has grown to look pretty normal, but we're going to use some nail technology in this area. So I've clipped the nails, I'm going to file them, get that filing done. A lot of times people say, oh, well, aren't you supposed to file from corner to center? Well, not exactly. I mean, you can start in the corner and then go in the center, but, you know, do it in whatever way you can to get yourself there. It's not going to ruin the nail. If you good stuff, we'll file them. How many people like to sit there and have their nails filed all day? You like that, Mark? Oh, just love it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Feels so good. Also, also the reflexology. You look forward to that. That's for sure. Well, that's the relaxing part of the manicure, and that's why people, most people, like to get manicures because it alleviates a lot of tension in the hands. Think about how many times we use our hands throughout the day in any occupation. Any occupation that people have, the hands are taxed the most from anything. So it's, it's a wise practice to get a regular manicure, not only for the health and maintenance of your nails, but to have a relaxation relief within your life. You know, here's our, our fun nail that we like to take care of. Man, this nail's come a long way, hasn't it? Yeah, it certainly has. I remember it was it was almost almost brown. Mm -hmm. We're going to use a little high-tech resin in here in order to fill in the ridges. And that gives us a smooth base. Actually, actually this the my uh, my this particular fingernail was caught in a press and then in an industrial accident when I was was years and years ago. That's how it happened. Well just after a little resin on there and the, the spray, we've got a nice smooth surface. Mm -hmm. Getting our nails filed here. Of course this kind of seems tedious, doesn't it? Just doing this Little by little, we should have like a lap dissolve point in this, you know, like, oh, well, here we go from this.